people love to uphold science and math. Rightfully so, unless they interfere with their politics. And then that righteousness goes right out the window. Case in point, mathematician Ted Hill just got censored from publication due to the interference of a group known as Women in Mathematics. Hill and his colleague wrote a paper about something known as the Greater Male Variability Hypothesis, which asserts that there are more idiots and more geniuses among men than there are among women. The variability part is that there are more men on the extremes, while women tend to be more stable in the middle with less variability. The hypothesis has been around for a while, and there are lots and lots and lots of studies that back it up. So Hill was studying it and came up with a mathematical argument based on biological and evolutionary principles. And his model seemed to check out with other smart people approving it. So Hill submitted it for publication in the Mathematical Intelligencer in the viewpoint section. After some back and forth with the editor-in-chief, a woman named Marjorie Seneschal, the paper, was approved for publication. But at the same time, that whole thing was going down at Google when their engineer James Damore asserted that biological factors played a role in gender disparities in high-tech jobs. So the PC police were on the lookout for anyone else who might say something similar. And so lo and behold, once Hill's colleague posted a preprint of their article online, they immediately got a call from a representative from women in mathematics. The rep said, while she recognized the soundness of their paper, she feared that it might be used by sexists for sexist reasons. And so yada, 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 before they knew it, the female editor at Mathematical Intelligencer called to say they would not be publishing their very sound paper after all because women in mathematics were censoring them. Which to me gives women a really bad name. I mean, come on. What women in math do is censor it? That's horrible. Science and math are all about the process and growth, not fixed beliefs. It's a living, breathing thing. You have to be able to listen to new input and grow from it. That's how it works. You have to accept findings you don't like. Besides, what's wrong with the hypothesis that men are all over the spectrum while women are more stable? You could argue that disproves another theory, that women are the hysterical ones because of their hormones. This theory makes men the more unstable ones. But nope, instead, women in mathematics want to censor it because it makes them uncomfortable or it might hurt someone's feelings, which is a lot worse than the greater male variability hypothesis, if you ask this woman.